I, uh, this video is about uh, isometric projection of a pentagon pyramid. So this is the problem statement here that the one side of pentagon pyramid is perpendicular to the vertical plane. So if I go back here, uh, this side that is perpendicular uh, to this, uh, this is a vertical plane here. Uh, this side it is perpendicular to the vertical plane. Okay, uh, then draw the projection of this pentagon pyramid in a first angle so it is in a first angle so the first part we need to draw the projection uh, based on this shape uh, sitting like this okay if i go back here after that pentagon pyramid is lifted such a way that it makes 30 degree with the horizontal plane and one side still say perpendicular to horizontal plane so if you think here um, Let's, if you hold this tip and lift this pentagon pyramid, uh, then it, you have to lift such a way from the top that it makes 30 degree from the base and this horizontal plane. Okay, so that's the second part of the problem. Okay, so here let's see if I lift this one uh, and then you lift like this and then the angle between the base of this pyramid, I mean the pentagon pyramid and this um, horizontal plane that angle is 30 degree okay so that's the second part of the problem okay so uh, this one it shows in a without uh, lifting the pyramid from the top so if you look from the top view you will see this pentagon here and then uh, you will see the sides here that will represent each uh, facet of this pentagon pyramid now when you look from the front view uh, you able to see this line edge here so that edge is extended over here and it represent that edge another edge you will able to see uh, this one so that is shown by here and uh, this is the center here so that will help you to draw this uh, front view and the third edge you will be able to see this one where the mouse is here so that will uh, you will add you will draw this third edge here okay so that's how you draw the front view now from the side view here you are able to see only three side this one second and third uh, these two they will be on the back side so this the, those two side will be in the dotted so once we extend all this line of uh, this second third 4, 5, when you extend here and then you make it 45 degree, you extend all the 5 lines here and then you draw vertical lines here. Uh, this one, it will help you to give the height of the pentagon pyramid. Once you have that one, uh, you can draw this shape which shows the side view of the pentagon pyramid. Okay, So that's the first part of the problem. Now this is they saying that now you have to leave the pyramid so that this base here it make 30 degree between the horizontal plane so this figure shows that thing now you have lifted the pyramid here it is making 30 degree so you start with this one first here now once you have that one cover you draw all the lines at the downs here to draw the uh, to draw the top view here uh, first thing you draw this uh, pyramid here uh, this pentagon here once you have the pentagon uh, then you can extend this edge at uh, the top once you have the top here then you can connect these lines here okay. and these five lines and that will give you the top view of this pyramid after it is uh, lifted 30 degree so that it can make the 30 degree between the this is the horizontal plane here so you start with the front view first top view and then you extend all this line here from this top view and from this side view and once you draw all uh, extend all this line you draw this pentagon here because uh, this one will give you the the size of the pentagon um, pentagon here uh, this edge and this second edge that will give you the 
height of the pentagon and this one it will give you the width of the pentagon from this end to that end okay so that's how you draw this pentagon here and then this will help you to give the the height of the pentagon pyramid and then once you have it you extend all this line there is only one piece missing here is the this dotted line should be here i'm just adding it here and those line will be dotted because you won't be able to see those they are on the back side So hopefully this helped you to understand how to draw the isometric projection of a pentagon pyramid. Uh, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching. Okay, bye.